Hello guys, and welcome back to the Stalag build of a prison. So when you last left off, uh, we had just finished some of these buildings, and I just also realized I need to build a goddamn bench, which kind of screws up with my um, perfect build. <laughs> Not perfect. But uh, how I visualized this uh, stuff, so it will just have to be there. I don't want to delete the bed, even though I'm then turning every holding cell down to nine because nine is not a round number, and that kind of screws me with my brain. So, um, god damn it! Well, um, I will continue for uh, furnishing. These uh, and oh damn, uh, maybe yeah. As uh, these these guys, uh, of course, when you have as I have done, so the saving. There we go. Um, in this direction, it's a problem. In this direction, it's not a problem, as you can see. Uh, I'm talking about the oven that's on the recreational table. This one. So, uh, I will be doing just like I did with this, when the door is facing this way. Just placing it like so. So they will have some centralized heating in their good old bunkhouse, which is very nice for them. And uh, what reminds me, I need to place a writing table, maybe. Maybe. Maybe they should have one. Maybe it would be nice, though. Maybe at this kind of uh, this separation wall there. Yeah. So uh, ideally, I would just have, uh, or maybe I should actually. Now that I'm thinking of it, maybe I should turn down because it, there's a lot of people in this uh, this. Uh, holding cells if you will so I will be oops bump the microphone I will actually be demolishing or dismantling four bed uh, two beds in each uh, holding cell and then I can move the bench and the writing tables so it doesn't look all that like a panic solution if you will and excuse me for and a boom uh, turning off steam or so that it doesn't pop up like that. Stupid me, silly me. So uh, maybe I should do this with all of them. Just place the, or no? What's it called? Uh, um, 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 the saying that uh, diversity is uh, something. Diversity is good, basically. Yes. Uh, is not my intention. God damn it. Like that. So, uh, still, we need to place those blast benches. There we go. And we, we're just putting the writing desk right next to it. Maybe I should add a chair as well. Just to make it like look like a writing desk. But yeah, this will be rather boring to watch for you, I believe. I will be furnishing all of these holding cells uh, away from camera and when I come back they will be all furnished and I will start on this shower yard uh, cons uh, not concept area so I will be seeing you in the future okay so right now I've just finished every last of those cells uh, or holding rooms and um, I just had to take some of these uh, damn grants and build. I had to build a staff room uh, to just finish a grant, unless we want. Uh, and the same with this, I have to build a medical ward. So what? Um, <coughs> just for the time being, I will have to. So how how do I want to do this? Yeah. Going like this, then 
something like that. So I can actually have a sizable building. Like so. And uh, yeah, it's quite difficult to just... I, I did uh, use a mod I also used earlier. Uh, the grant mod. That, um, the government grant mod or whatever. Uh, that gives you five fifty thousand. Uh, which helped me quite a lot. However, it wasn't enough. So I had to do that to just... I have to take these grants basically to finish and for some damn reason you need to have toilets in the bathrooms it's cool but right right now I just wanted to have this shower area yeah so <laughs> somebody had to sit in the corners take a shit if they or they can if they want to of course um, also in f uh, the electrical and uh, uh, waterish watery infrastructure is placed down the pipes that is and oh, pause. Um, the infirmary will be over here. Medical beds placed like that. And um, yeah, fuck. We need to build. Yeah, we can build the offices here, of course. Some sort of office, office for officials. Um, to. Uh, we need a fifth office. That's what I'm trying to say. We don't just have four, and uh, or well, maybe I can just say screw you guys because in reality they placed all their goddamn offices in the middle of the woods, and that's also something um, which I should be doing is planting a forest around this place because um, usually uh, the the these prison camps were built in outside cities, in the middle of nowhere. Uh, they would just clear out a enormous area in the woods and uh, build their camps there. And that's why uh, in Poland they find mass graves uh, in, uh, for example, Poland, also in Germany and Russia and wherever. Uh, Germany and the Soviet were involved in occupation and combat. They find massive mass graves uh, where people have been just dumped, and that's usually outside of these uh, prison camps. But yeah, um, so now we are. We didn't really need that office though. But, uh. Yeah, uh office. Where's the office? There we go. Just have it, you psychologist. We don't need psychologists here. Or the staff do, because we're crazy, evil people, and uh, we will be placing some light. Feel the doctors, and um, that's it for right right this moment. Maybe I can choose no. Yeah, we have to we have to do this basic stuff, and maybe also. Yeah, some. No, oh, wait, what? Locked or the way? Well, anyways, we will be in death. So, yeah, blah blah blah. I'm blabbing away. We have finished these, which is very nice right now. Um, I will not be flooring these until we have a stable income, and I can afford that because that's just for the aesthetic, which is uh, what I'm trying to go for, of course. But when I need the money, and I can't be flooring out these places, and so oh, we have a nice floor, but we don't have a kitchen. We can't eat, but we have nice floors. So that is kind of second uh, uh, in line. What we will do is call this pl whole place for the yard. Bam. And in the yard. Or basically the area where they have to walk. There's going to be some benches. There's going to be some lights. And those junctions as well. And uh, maybe not anything more. Maybe. Do we need to place anything else? 
we have kind of every base covered exercise will be do done by running they will just run around they can have fun they can have family they can shit they can sleep and peace of course you can sit yeah basic human rights <laughs> if you believe that kind of nonsense um, light those up as well so yeah it's coming along very nice as it will have to say and uh, the next job is to get this uh, administration shit going up so I will just pause and of course come right back when I have fenced in and placed down the buildings so I will be seeing you right there okay so um, I'm coming back yet again uh, instead of modding the save file which is kind of cheaty um, <laughs> I am kind of having to postpone this uh, just for a moment because we have to finish this basic detention center thing and I also took the education reform program and what I will eventually do is tear down the classrooms after 15 POWs has passed the foundation and 5 has passed this just I want that money that's 55,000 55, rush mark uh, and you get 15 on, the, on just accepting it which is the reason firstly why I went for it and the secondly I have to pass it now that I took it so we have to build ourselves a canteen and a kitchen first and foremostly now the thing with these buildings in the Stalags is that they are kind of the same although you can come away with building a square for a hole. one side should be larger than the other and then again it shouldn't be too gargantuan but we are going to have a lot of prisoners so maybe you just have to let that one slide so what I am uh, going to have to do is just uh, plot out where these towers are supposed to be from the middle from to there to the wall is 21 21 really Jesus Christ oh boy five there we go and then we have 17 and 17 is th where the wall is supposed to be like that and there we have 16 which is yeah just let that one go just let it be and then uh, we will have a path going down like that. This one is now 26 by 34, which oops, is a rather large canteen, if I must, can say so myself. So the workshop and laundry will be in here as well. Once that comes, that kind of loop time comes. Sorry, my tongue is like curling all over the place this day. Today. Um, 16 and 16, yeah. So, I will be building whoopsie daisy like that. And then we'll have to place it down. Poof. So, yeah, uh, right now we have a storage. I've moved the offices down here, and uh, this will be our guardsman barracks. And this right here, I'm not really sure just yet. Just place the remaining administration stuff in there. Maybe the kennel, the morgue, and the security. If we ever want to build a security office. Uh, yeah, so. Oh, yawning. Not good. Uh, so, yeah. I just have to be creative, I think. About uh, what I will do there. And. Uh, I may want to place down this fencing. Yeah, I, I'm I'm pretty happy about how this situation is. Uh, Money-wise, it's kind of a hassle, and it's kind of an ambitious project, uh, ambitious project.
project to do uh, without s um, editing the save file so you give yourself more cash it's doable uh, it, that mod which give me 50,000 is also really handy to have but as you can see uh, we can finally we can start big go in with a bag I've already I've done these guys and I remember uh, firstly you had only five grants I think and that wasn't really going to cut it so those bonuses by building the bunkhouse A and going all the way down really helps that they give you that much cash because it's expensive to build cells like this but yeah and uh, also we'll mention no metal detectors I will be having to manually search the prisoners because there weren't metal detectors back in these days and if there were, I don't think uh, they had them in the Stalags because normally we would de-weaponize people uh, when they came in and the stuff, I don't think they really could steal anything from yeah, 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 well they did maybe, but what could we would it do? You couldn't really escape from these places it would be beset upon by vicious dogs and guards beating you to death if they caught you so yeah and if you eventually ride it, uh, would ride it out the white buses would be came uh, came can come and you would be fine if you're patient of course <laughs> I'm just kidding um, I believe people stole all manner of things to weaponize themselves against guards and I believe also a lot of people must have escaped that I am not too sure about so you may have to want to read about it but uh, yeah so now we have kind of lighted out the whole place which is nice and um, while it's happening I may want to check how do I want to place this stuff yeah the thing is though it's not don't have to be all that space efficient here because we are going to we have so much space to play with that it doesn't really matter so it's, it's just gonna be a place for shitloads of people anyways and uh, I think they ate in mess halls or I think they were handed food in tents outside no matter how bad the weather was uh, normally water with red coloring so it was like oh this is tomato soup my ass <laughs> and uh, uh, yeah low nutrition stuff because uh, yeah being a soldier uh, may have been worse actually than being in prison of course your own wouldn't really punish you but um, the rations, uh, especially later in the war, being a soldier in, in the German army was a pain in the butt because uh, the industry were failing, they were totally bombed, um, the Russians, Americans and British were storming in, they lost everything, so in the end they were as ill uh, equipped as the Russians were in the beginning of the war, which kind of um, is a fate fate you deserve when you start off like that so uh, nobody deserves to be involved in a world war and being killed mercilessly but yeah so now we are finishing up on this place um, this video will be more building next video maybe we take in the first load of prisoners right now I'm not uh, I'm not done yet as you can probably tell um, and also I will want to place this as a, or name this as a kitchen yeah this is so big I remember uh, back in early alphas when workshops didn't really have any work related stuff so you could Every idle area was turned into a workshop, so you earned uh, cash on a 
uh, like two dollars per tile of workshop space and uh, that sort of things kind of funny um, that is of course uh, that exploit is removed now as you can probably tell so now we are kind of scraping the bottom of the barrel here we are running out of cash we can't take loan I have the chefs the only thing I'm missing now is the kitchen so if I, I can loan enough to build like buy the sink and the stove and of course uh, what's the name of it the stove and the fridge refrigerator so we will be doing that and I'm maybe that will be the end of the episode yeah that's Christmas can yeah look at that we can't take so much loans we're going to go out with a bang going bankrupt so sealed Berlin SV 11 5th of August 1990 1944 so well yeah that's uh, basically not much left of Germany at that point it would be uh, I believe uh, that's also when the Russians uh, came in over. What's th what's the name of that place again? Oh, I know in Call of Duty, World at War. You are going there. It's in Poland. Um, it's the Battle of. Uh, yeah, I can't. I can't it just eludes me that name. But uh, yeah, so if this is 1944, 5th of August, we are. Yeah, the Russians might be on our doorstep. What will happen is that we take in a lot of Russians and then they will be freed and we'll be, we'll be killed. Which will be sad. But maybe a befitting fate for us, since we are douchebags. Imprisoning people, making them freeze, shit and sleep in the same room. All manner of dirty things people so soon the kitchen will finish come on there's like two beams of steel one more one more come on come on come on oh I hate the prioritizing why the fuck do you go all the way over there just turn every single tile of that into deliveries and boom suck on that so here we go now this is done I will pause I will call this a kitchen and don't go all mad and place down thousands of cookers it's like two for now uh, fridges and then some sinks three sinks we'll have to cut it not because I'm a cheapskate, but that is actually a lot of things. So, what are you thinking about? <laughs> Offending Germans. I'm sorry. Um, yeah, so just having an overlook uh, on our Stalag right here. I could just skip everything and just come when ev uh, I built everything up, but where's the fun in that? Um, so we have our compound, if you will, where prisoners are confined. They are going to do all their, uh, satisfy all their needs except eating and, uh, yeah, eating and eating. <laughs> um, this is where they will spend ma the majority of, no, 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 not the majority. They will be working, of course, but other than that, they will be spending the majority of free time in this area, hopefully. And this uh, will be the canteen area. Now, this may not be how you like it, but I'm be a bi the problem is that the game isn't really optimized for this kind of stuff. So when I'm having almost a hundred prisoners, I can't be building a very small nestle. And multiple, uh, then you have to zone them. And uh, I believe uh, 
if you have multiple kitchens they will also they will just the, I don't think I think the cooks are you, you should be able to designate workplaces for the workers as well is what I'm trying to say so having two kitchens it will still keep serving that one canteen which I tried uh, a long time ago and it didn't really think um, work out as I hoped but anyways we will now just for the hell of it place down some patrol routes. Just to finish these grants and then I will be calling it a day. And dogs as well. Bark bark. Woof woof. And like that. So we should now see another grant. Fantastic. And we may as well buy these guys. So and the kitchen is done, fantastic. So that is everything for now. I think we kind of have we've done a lot, or I have done a lot. You have just been watching, you lazy bastards. <laughs> um, next time we will finish and take in our prisoners. I will see to that 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 will happen. So um, thank you for watching. Please subscribe this mod on the Steam Workshop. It's very great. If you like these kinds of prisons, uh, please like the video, please comment if you will, and please subscribe. And I will be seeing you next time. Bye bye.